What's up everybody, Nabori here. Today we're gonna to be doing the story quest, A Child's Secret, okay? We're gonna to have to go here and check with Flora, I guess. So let's go on over here. Dude, I am almost level 40. I am so stoked. Guys, we're almost there, okay? The next checkpoint. And I'm curious, what level are you guys at? Let me know, what's your AR right now? Let's see what you gotta say, what's up? Oh, what the hell? Whoa! Floaty imaginary friend for floaty headed Flora. A bloaty floaty. A bloaty floaty? Let me turn this up real quick. All right. Wait, imaginary friends can be plants now? <laughs> no, it's invisible, Paimon. <laughs> hi, traveler. Well, maybe, I hi, guess. Bard. Uh, hi, uh, Flora. Can I ask sure. you a question? How can I help? Uh, who's your friend? Oh, Mr. Most Floody. People can't see him. Well, guess Mr. what? Mr. Floody is my Again. bestest friend. We grew up together. Okay. Uh, no fair. Paimon hates feeling left out. Paimon's, Paimon's tilted. Let me turn this up a little bit. Let me turn that up a little bit. I can't hear anything. Flora, why exactly are you friends with the bloaty floaties? <laughs> the bloaty floaties, yo. What's wrong with it? I always wanted to be friends with a plant who could fly. Weirdo. Friends with a flying plant? Why? Yeah, like why? <laughs> because then when it's windy, <laughs> you and your friend can fly off into the sky together. Hmm. You got to admit that's pretty cool. Yeah, but what if the bloody floaty pops, dude? You're in dead, dude. You are that's dead. Called being blown away. <laughs> that's what some people like to call it. Yeah. <laughs> I mean being blown away could be uh, well, I don't know. Found out this plant existed from an explorer who told me stories of his adventures. Huh. All right. I think his name was uh, Stanley. Stanley. Oh, I know Stanley. He's got the steamer. Stanley's an adventurer. Yeah. And you can tell he's an expert at it from the stories he tells. He's trash. <laughs> the amazing adventures of Stanley are super famous in Mondstadt. Man, he ain't got shit on me. He's in the city at the moment. You should go ask him to tell you some of his stories. I'm gonna I'm slap him in his mouth. That's what I'm gonna do. That sounds like a fun idea for next time. But uh, right now we have other things to attend to. Yeah, maybe that's a... You know be crazy if that was actually another quest that happened now. All right, bloody floaties. Um, we gotta go see Timmy. Timmy, 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 Timmy. The mysterious kid Timmy. Isn't he the... Okay. He's the dude on the bridge. He's the dude on the bridge. You know what? Let's, um... Yeah. All right. So while we're here, okay, I know you guys have been trying to get. We're gonna we're gonna pull out the squad, okay? We got Fischl, we got Kaching, but you know who we're gonna pull out? We're gonna pull out our level fifty three. Clee. Clean. All right. I don't know if you guys have seen Clean yet, Clee yet, but we got her. Ooh, I just killed a bird. Whoa! You see his pet? His imaginary friend? Oh my! That thing is huge. No way! What a beast! Unexpected. Definitely. Timmy's imaginary friend is a ruin scar? Whoa! Am I uh, seeing I'm things or? Out right now. That thing is sure to attack us. <laughs> it's imaginary, you uh, silly. Uh, uh, what say you? We postpone our conversation with Timmy for the time being. That line you love to say so much there, Venti. Huh? Paimon has a favorite line? <laughs> the one about exploring the area? Ahead of us later? Uh, seriously? Oh, yeah. all right then. How about we explore the area ahead of us later? <laughs> okay. Thanks, Paimon. How about... Children are more open-minded. Oh. Is that why they can think up all kinds of imaginary friends? Yeah. Oh, Maybe. Funny, isn't it? That the city of freedom should be home to children with such boundless powers of imagination. Like, do you guys still? Do you well, what about adults' imaginations? Huh. Let's ask some adults in the tavern. That's true. I wonder if any of the adults at the tavern have an imagination. Do you? Did you guys have an imaginary friend when you guys were growing up? I don't think I did. I I don't I don't think I had that experience, unfortunately. Did you guys? What did you guys have? Did you have a dog? Did you have a cat that was imaginary? Did you have an alien thing? Did you have a snake? What did you have? Was it another person? Yeah, how freaky is that though? Like, I don't know. I, I didn't have an imaginary friend or real friends. No, I'm just kidding. I had a couple friends. Not really. <laughs> Maybe they were imaginary. Oh, no. Whew. 
Maybe, uh, maybe, maybe, maybe they were imaginary. Maybe, woo wee. And it's happening. I wonder if any of these guys and, or girls have a drop in the tavern. Let's see what the adults got. Adults, adults, adults. Do I talk to him? What's up, Jack? What you got? Uh, got it right here. Wait, I had to give him something. I mean, it was a joke for an adventurer to lose the handbook during an adventure. Uh, thanks. I'll keep these things close uh, from now. Please take this as a token of my appreciation. I don't even remember getting him anything. I mean, I mean, I'll take it. I mean, it's free money. What's up, Nelson? What you got? Uh, Want to join me? Come on. Oh, he's drunk. Want to join me? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Have a seat. Um, yeah, about Storm Terror. Uh, <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> I think that uh, now I uh, that's is all over. <laughs> I can finally proudly declare that a month that is uh, a great place. <laughs> the scenery is good <laughs> and the wine is fine <laughs> and the nights are fun. Is <laughs> they got girls with big booties. <laughs> oh wait, <laughs> well defend us. Uh, the curse comes. <laughs> Uh, the crisis. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Uh, that's what uh, they, that's what they call the great. My man is trashed, bro. So why don't we talk to the dude on the outside? I guess I don't know. Charles, Charles. I guess I guess we didn't have to do that, but we, we ran into some drunk people and we uh, finished a quest on an accident. Whoopsies. Yo, my man is drunk. Did you hear how drunk that dude was? He couldn't even finish his own sentence. Okay. Does it want me to go outside? Inside? I'm so confused. It's like pointing me. Oh, they. Oh, yo, the get. Yo, Deluke, what's he doing? He's scheming. Oh, the snap! The pirates. Is, you have to drink it at the tavern, or you miss out on half the fun. Hmm. Okay. It seems to me you'd find some way of keeping yourself amused, even if you drank alone. Hmm. <laughs> if I didn't know any better, I would say you're being deliberately uncivil. You think they're gonna kiss? Just drink responsibly on my premises, okay? All right, sure. Oh, and if I did have one too many, they're flirty. What then, you'd throw me out along with the trash. Is that it? Throw you out? <laughs> you know, the same way you threw out father's legacy. Oh snap! You sold off Wait. his mansion, or maybe you've forgotten. They're brothers? I see no reason to cling to things that have outlived their purpose. Wait a second. Is that so? Then I trust you were most swift indeed to part with a certain vase. Yo, they're brothers. Sorry. Fire and I ice. Have no recollection. That's odd. Yeah, please don't kiss because them. Because Master Diluc definitely has a vase at home. A beautiful one, unmistakable in fact. Oh. All right, who's got an imaginary friend? Really, none of them. Man. Seems our suspicions were right. Hmm. Grown-ups don't appear to have imaginary friends. This is true. Like I said, a lack of childlike wonder. Yeah. So people just stop dreaming when they grow up? Yikes. Okay, well, Paimon for one never wants to grow up. Yeah, I never growing up, I, I never I never stopped dreaming, okay? You know? I dreamed about playing video games for a living. And well, damn, we made it happen, alright? Let's see. <laughs> Guys, keep chasing your dreams, okay? You might lose your imaginary friends, but you can still dream, chase your dreams, and make it happen, you know? You never know. You never know. Hard work, baby. Question. Let's go. At what age exactly do people's imaginary hmm. friends disappear? That's a good question. When did you guys lose it? I don't know. Let's go and check. Hmm. Okay. Let's uh let's check it out. Where are we going? Surely hmm. must have some imagination left. Surely. You think? Maybe. You know what? Somehow Paimon finds the idea of not being able to see Ellen's imaginary friend kind of scary. Hmm. That's true. Yo, she, her run is so good. Look at her. She's. I, I'm going to run like that. Like when I go outside for a run, when I go outside for a run, I'm going to run like she does. All right. I'm going to run like Clee does. Do you think, is, think anybody will look twice? We're like, what the hell is this weirdo doing? He must be a clean main. Yeah, could you imagine if someone... <laughs> Speaking of, someone actually... So I wear these headphones at the gym sometimes. They're really big, right? 
and um, somebody came up to me and they're like, hey bro, like, do you game? And I'm like, do I game? <laughs> Come on, do you not know who I am? No, I didn't say <laughs> But I said, yeah, I game. It was pretty cool. It was pretty interesting. And actually someone has recognized me at the gym recently. Uh, it, was, it was pretty interesting. They were like, oh, snap. Nabori? I was like, what? What's up, dude? Give him dabs, you know what I'm saying? Let me, you know, use Purell on her hands because, you know, COVID. Oh, wait. Okay, that's weird. Jean? What is Jean doing here? <laughs> is Master Jean Ellen's imaginary friend? <laughs> what? Ellen is a, uh, so a child, she's yeah. So determined to become a knight that she. Okay, that's hmm. kind of weird. <laughs> yeah, dude. Hmm? Oh, hello. What are you guys doing? <laughs> I don't know. Shit, what are you doing? Are you always training here? You bet. Today, I heard Stanley talking about his adventures. Huh. It was incredible. It got me really pumped up. Oh, yeah. Tell me oh, more. I hope I can be as outstanding as him one day. Yeah. <laughs> so that you can fight shoulder to shoulder with Master Gene? Nice. <laughs> I... I mean, obviously, I want to become a hmm. knight. And if I got to go on an adventure with Jean herself, well, even better. So she's not being weird about it yet. Seems Ellen really looks up to Jean. I believe you'll succeed. Oh, thanks. Sure. I was thinking, it's not every day I get to hang out with the honorary knight. <laughs> Would you join me for some sword training? Yeah, you know, what can I say? Sure. Oh. How can I smash all these training dummies at once? Oh, she wants me to do this? Okay, so what you do is you go like this. And then you go like this. And then you go... Boink. That didn't work. <laughs> that didn't work. At oh, she's not strong enough. So it just wants me to strum. Okay, it doesn't care when I... Okay, it doesn't care. So that's how to do it. I didn't do it right. I thought that was going to blow it all up, but it didn't when it touched it. Thanks, man. I, I'm amazing. Oh, thank you. It's clear I still have a long way to go in my training. Yeah, just pull some bombs out of your asshole and then just swing a big sword. You'll be alright. So modest. I for one think you're quite the pro at this already. Yeah, dude. Let's see what you got. Well, I'm exhausted from training, so clearly my fitness needs some work. Mm. One day, though, I'll smash all the training dummies in Mondstadt. Oh yeah. Ellen, Ellen, she's our girl. If she can't do it, um, Hilly Churl. What the f? Oh, thanks. Shoot, I got so caught up here, I forgot there's something else. Hilly Churl! <laughs> Bruh. Oh, but I'm so sore from training. I can hardly move. You know what? I hear a lot of fucking complaining. <laughs> Honorary Knight. Could you deliver a message to Jack for me? Oh my god, you want to be a knight, but you're making me do your chores? <sighs> sure, where can I find him? at the Temple of the Lion with Stanley today. Okay, my mustache keeps going up my nose. Stanley's a truly legendary adventurer. So I heard. Renowned in all of Mondstadt. He once set foot in the Mayor Javari. Whatever. We're going to meet up tonight and discuss adventure plans. <sighs> Could you let him know it'll have to be another day? <sighs> Fine, Temple of the Lion, sure. Great. Missed that place, Thank I guess. So much. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. All right, how far? Oh, ooh, bro, we're almost forty. Bro, this quest might get us to forty. I'm so. Okay, so we need to go to the line. So we might as well just teleport, right? Bro, we're almost. Dude, this might. We we're we're the tip. We're at the tip. We're almost there, dude. So close. It's not this much. It's like. This much dude we're almost there i'm so ready hang on let me pick up this oh that's not <laughs> wait what all right fine it didn't want us to pick up that weed all right here we go um investigate the hideout we've already done that possible rewards here we go bing 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 okay we got everybody what's up crew we don't have cryo nobody cares about cryo do you unless you have a. Uh, uh what's the other guy what's the, what's the other dude that's got the ice with the 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 swords that come back this dude's nuts whoa we did. During the storm terror incident. Mm -hmm. That is true, Paimon. Now a hot spot for adventurers. Oh yeah? That can only mean one thing. Looks like 
we can't go any further. Not to worry. Allow me. We didn't bag all the loot. Let's last go, baby. Windshield and soaring sky high. Sky high. Yeah, dude, with your your uh, pants, your pantyhose, whatever you. <laughs> oh, ooh, is that a chest, bruh? Bro, if this levels me, I'm gonna snap. Oh, okay. We're 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 actually quite a ways away, but I didn't really. We, I thought we were closer than that. Blink. Nothing behind there. Got it. Got it. Got it. Oh, we gotta put the thing in the thing. Boom! 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 We done. Kaching. Hey, oh. What's up, Hilly Trolls? She, I didn't put really in much gear on this character, so Klee is kind of poopy right now. So she's kind of used for just that, and then like this, and then we just do that. So stuff like that. She's actually really damn strong, but I, I literally have no gear on her right now, so. She's good for, right now for me, is just applying fire. That's about it. That's about it. What's up, kids? What's up? What's up, y'all? Okay. Cool, 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 cool. The ashes, bro. I don't even know why I did that, to be honest. Wasting our alts for no reason. She's ka has got her ult back already. Isn't that nutty? Nutty. She's insane, bro. She is insane. Just running back and forth. What's up? Should we get the should we get our boy here? Blink. Wow, he doesn't. They gave him no damage. Who's your guys' favorite character right now? Mine is, um, it's still Beidou. Um, I haven't really transferred back to Kaching. Yo, my Beidou is crazy, bro. I got the, the, um, Gladiator set on her. She's gonna be sick. What's up? So, he's, he's very good for this. Watch this. Did that not? Okay. Okay, that did, that did do what I wanted. It went somewhere. That was so weird. Okay, that didn't work out the way I wanted to, but that's alright. We'll pan it out. We'll pan it out. Oh, shit. Alright, what's up? Kaching's my secondary main, basically. I use her in the the tower. Um, but yeah, she's my secondary. What's up, fellas? Give me this. So close, bro. If this, isn't, if this quest doesn't level, what's up, guys? Bro, you didn't do anything. Why are you... Why are you panting? I, so sure I, was about to die. I mean, I could still kill you. To be fair, that could have gone either way. Yeah. <laughs> so, you must be Jack the Adventurer. What's up, I bud? Assume? I mean, did, wasn't he just in the tavern? Yes. Who are you? Bro, do you not know who Actually, I am? We came looking for you. We did. Ellen has a message for you. She said she won't be able to join you today to plan out your next adventure. Because you're a bitch. She'll join you some other time. <laughs> Oh, I see. I feel bad you had to come all this way to find me, and then had to rescue me. Yeah, I mean... Huh? I don't see what all the fuss is about. It was nothing that I, Stanley, couldn't have dealt with... Stanley, by it looks like you were hiding in the corner crying with your pants down, Stanley. Oh, you are Stanley? <laughs> you were that legendary adventurer? Renowned in all of Mondstadt? Who once set foot in the Mare Javari? <laughs> the very same. You're trash. <laughs> I must say, it's an honor to meet one as legendary as yourself. I love how they're not calling him out. Well then, how would everyone like to proceed? Head uh, back or head further inside? Stanley, what do you think, you piece of shit? <laughs> well, I think you're now in the safe hands of Stanley. But I hope he falls Great off the edge. And legend of Mondstadt. All right. In which case, why well, head back now? Okay, motion passed by unanimous consent. Let's head further in. All right. Here we go. Let's see what happens with the... you mostly came here because you want to hear my adventure stories. Uh, right? nope. No, we really were just looking for Jack. Okay, let's go this way. Do you know who I am? Oh, that's why they gave us him. Okay. That's why they gave us him. It's so weird having a five button now. Stanley, the living legend, Stanley, who braved the man Jabari. Enough already. <laughs> Stanley's about Your to get kicked in the teeth. Every time you open your mouth. It's true, though. Stanley is the most amazing guy. 
Yeah, he sounds like a an ass hat to me. Oh, did I just get I just get interrupted? So we could use Kashing. Vaporize. Yeah, yeah. My Kaching isn't really leveled up that much either. She's got decent stuff, but I feel like she could be a lot better. She could be definitely be a lot better. Let's use a buddy here. But once we get 40, dude, we're going to be able to get a lot better gear, hopefully. A lot more options. Bro, is he still talking? Wow. So did he make it? This won't pull him in though, unfortunately. See, what's up, baby girl? Melt it, melt it, melt it. Her ult's strange. She actually does a ton of damage when she overloads. I'm definitely using her ult so bad. But that's all right. We're, we're just plowing through, right? We're just plowing through. Just bounce them all over the head. Bro, are you still in talking? Was anybody paying attention to what he was saying? I wasn't. I believe I've made a small discovery. Yeah. What? Could I ask you to use the Nernama detector once more? What the? F Wait a second. What do you what? mean? Family has an imaginary <laughs> friend. It seems his imaginary friend is a seasoned warrior, covered in scars from head to foot. And a look of staunch determination on his face. Fits Stanley's description of himself. You're saying his imaginary friend is an idealized version of his own self? Dang. Interesting idea. But is it true? I mean, it makes sense. Please excuse me. Uh, I'll be leaving now. Huh. He Bye, just... Stanley. <laughs> um... Okay. Stanley's crazy, dude. Do you two still have time to spare? For you? Nope. What is it? A few days ago, Stanley got drunk and told me a secret. Something he's never told anyone before. So why are you telling me his secret? You're just a big pe- <laughs> The weapons he took on his adventure all those years ago. They were none other than those once wielded by Mondstadt's greatest hero, Vanessa herself. Hmm. The sword of brilliant valor and the shield of magnificent honor. That's one thing. We haven't really seen a character with a shield, have we? I don't know whether you believe me, but apparently both the sword and shield are still right here in Mondstadt over in Dadaupa Gorge. Dadaupa. Since you guys are the experts at this, can you come with me to try and retrieve these two legendary weapons? So you're trying to steal his stuff. You bet. This is Stanley we're talking about. <laughs> Yikes. If I can just get a hold of something impressive enough to show my family what I'm capable of, maybe they'll finally come around to the idea of me being an adventurer. Yeah, but if I help you, that means you didn't do it. So your family's still going to think you're... <laughs> right now, I'm just a rookie. My abilities are limited. And my parents don't support my goals one bit. Yikes. So what do you say? Help a guy out? Man, you know what I would tell this dude? I'd be like, yo... I mean, uh, I'll tell I'll tell you what to do, but you got to do it yourself. You know what I mean? Like, I can't bring myself to tell Stanley about it because my reasons are so uh, selfish. But I swear I'll give the weapons back to him as soon as I'm done. Hmm. Aww, poor Jack. Hard to say no after that story. Not really, but. Fenty, you coming too? Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> Where are we going? Oh, one other thing. I have a bottle of rare vintage wine that I had someone oh. fetch for me a couple years ago. Help me find these weapons, and it's all yours. Yeah, Venti wants that. Uh, Dada Upa Gorge, was it? <laughs> Let's hurry. There's no time to lose. This is a damn alcoholic, yo. The damn alcoholic, bruh. Oh, my man's chilling. Dude, he's pissed. See his eyebrows? He's pissed. Bro, we hit 40. Bro, we just hit 40. You guys seen this? World level increased. Do I really want to do that? I feel like I'm going to get my ass torn up. Oh, bro, we finally did it. 40. We finally did it. With minimal money spent. 
in Genshin Impact. Okay, we did we did spend a little bit, probably like a hundred, hundred and maybe thirty dollars, but that's wild. Okay, that's wild. Are we gonna go down here? It's right down at the bottom. I, that's so convenient that it's actually down here. Yo, that's crazy. Let's try. I don't think I can level up my characters, right? Yep. Let's see. 70, 70. We're gonna be we're gonna be leveling her up first. Ascend. Okay, so I can. Electro bonus 18%. We do need more of these. One more of these. I think I have enough of these. I don't know if I have enough of these. We can craft those. But I do have enough of these, which is a pain in the butt to get. So we do have that. And we have all these characters. So we have um, we got Venti, we got Ching, we got Beidou, we got Zhang. I don't even know how to say her name yet, okay? Don't judge me. Um, all those can get the 80. We could get her up too. Um, it requires the same things as Beidou, so that's that's tough. But we definitely need to get our fire characters up still. But And we do have a 49 Barbara. Barbara's just there to be heal bot, I swear. Right, because he wanted both. Okay, it's over by the. They did a lot of things over here. Oh, there it is. Whoa. Can I go through here? Dang, I can. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. What's up, fellas? Whoop. Skirt. Okay, so they're. Oh, dang, they're 68. Wow. They really leveled up this quest. Oh, what's up, Papa? Touch me. Thank you. My counter doesn't do as much anymore as it did before. Reason being is I picked up more physical damage on my... Oh, crap. My thing didn't come up. I picked up more damage on my physical for the... Um, just to boost that. We dropped some of the attack. So we're losing some of our damage from our counter. I am almost dead. Alright, we got the Sword of Valor. That thing looks like garbage. <laughs> Lo and behold, the sword of brilliant valor. Okay. Are you sure? <laughs> Looks kind of basic to Paimon. Yeah. And a little oh. oil and hilly trolls be bowing down before a piece of junk like this. <laughs> uh, uh, seems somebody tossed an old sword into a pile of spoils these hilly trolls were already celebrating. So. This is in terrible shape. And it's so basic, I... I can't be it. <sighs> I'm at a loss for words. Hmm... Say, Jack, have you ever seen an Animo crystal fly? I bet you he They're took it. found in the open country around Mondstadt City. If you saw one in broad daylight, you wouldn't bat an eyelid. But in the pitch blackness of night, huh. its brilliant glow is mesmerizing. It truly resembles an exquisite crystal dancing in the night air. So what are you trying to say, kid? Is Valor not the same? When everything is going your way, it seems meaningless. Fades into the background. But when you're in dire straits... Valor is the thing that gets you fired up and fighting back. It's the brilliant ray of light that guides you out from the darkness. Yeah, well, almost fell for that one, but uh, we'll just do excellent recovery. You're right. <laughs> You're right. Then this has to be it. This is the sword of brilliant valor. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. So, we got our sword. He just... Now we just need that shield. He just wants the alcohol, bro. Scout around. It's definitely in Dada Upa Gorge, so... Uh, huh? There's somebody there. Yeah, I bet he took it. He switched it out. Stanley? What's he doing? I mean, he's taking his shit back, dude. Something so weird. <laughs> what happened? Why did you stop all of a sudden? Uh huh? Oh, uh, it's nothing. Uh, just one of those Mora spouting weasel thieves pass by as well. Yikes. Oh, the weasel thieves. Literally the weasel thieves. You know things in the ground? <laughs> we have a shield to find, remember? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, let's get this quest over with, right? Let's. Oh, good, it's in the same area. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do we get to fight Stanley? Or do we get to fight Stanley and his imaginary friend? Ooh-wee! Eh, eh, come on, Barbara. Where could it be? So it's over here somewhere. My characters are almost dead, so let's heal. Boink. Yeah, we can do it! Go, Barbara, go! Perfect. All right, where art thou? Aha, easy enough. Oh, oh God. Lo and behold, the shield of magnificent honor. Oh God. Liar, liar, pants on fire. It's, it's a, a chunk, chunk of wood. 
A chunk of scrap wood with the handle attached. Who in their right mind would use this as a shield? A holy troll? There's also wine stains on it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this was just taken from a wine barrel. Oh, God. And yet, my bard's intuition tells me that this is none other than the Shield of Magnificent Honor. Warriors wear their battle scars with pride, and shields are no different. Surely an intact shield is one that has shied away from the battlefield. Is not the broken and splintered shield the one that has fought in countless wars and lived to tell the tale? It's probably shitty, then. Though the soldier's body be tired and torn, still they fight till the very end, till they have no blood left to bleed. Such magnificent strength of will. Is that not the true meaning of Venti is in top form today. I agree with Venti. You do have a point. Shiny new shields don't stay new and shiny for long. <laughs> okay, then. Well, maybe if we ask nicely, he'll just let us take the shield of magnificent honor for free. <laughs> Are we going to talk to him? Ahem. Oh, God. Excuse me, Mr. Hilly Churro? <laughs> that lot? Well, okay. You take it from here. Hope you've picked up some Hilly Churrillion by now. If not, there's always body language. Vin Plata Dada. Oh, he loved it. Masimita. Seems cheerful enough. Maybe negotiating will work after all. All right. <clears throat> Kucho Pupu Gosha Yi. He didn't like it. Badiam! Uh oh. He did not seem to appreciate that. Mani Nanin Biadam Domu. Oh, he's pissed. Badam! Uh oh. Yaya Ika Kundala Yi Palala. We ticked him off big. I mean. Oh, he didn't like that. All right, hold this. Boing, 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 <laughs> what the <hell>? me? <laughs> Poor Haley Troll. Yeah, yeah. Guys, thank you so much. I can't believe I actually found them. Mom, Dad, check out the legendary weapons I found. Wait a second. What? Hey, wait! Who are you talking to? They're not. <laughs> Oh shit. Fine, you promised. Oh, I actually helped a lot this Bro, they can't hear you out here. <laughs> mm -hmm. What are you doing here, Stanley? Is that it? Uh, uh, hey, hey. What are you doing here, bud? Fancy that, huh? You uh, uh out for a stroll too? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I just like this blades of grass tickling my taint. Oh, that's right. An after dinner stroll to be precise. We were also helping a friend look for something. Mm. To think Stanley might be a fraud. He's definitely a fraud, no question or no. Did Stanley plant the sword and shield here in advance so as to not hurt Jack's killing? This is true. Adventurers must be pretty familiar with Dada Upa Gorge. You fought battles here before, after all. Hmm. <laughs> you better believe it. I can navigate this whole area with my eyes closed. Wow. And I admire your perseverance. And your memory, too. I guess you just gotta be nice, man. It's only to be expected of a great adventurer like me. You guys had better watch out, though. <laughs> this place is crawling with hillichurros. I, uh, I'll get back to my, um, uh, stroll. <laughs> Alright. That's actually, you, now that you think about it. Guilty conscience much? He planted those. That's kind of cute. To make, to make the other guy feel... Like he, uh, he could be the adventurer. That's actually kind of cute. Well, he shouldn't have gotten so carried away bragging to Jack, should he? I guess. Although nah, fuck that. <laughs> Trash. I am intrigued. Someone who can't let go of the past and gives up on the present instead. Sounds like a lot of fucking people. Someone who can't let go of the past 
and gives up on the present instead. Sounds like literally, I wouldn't say everybody, but a lot of people, man. A lot of people are, get that baggage, dude. They got that baggage on their back that makes them lose sight of what they can do in the future. You know what I'm saying? I think we've all been in that place one time or another. You know what I'm saying? But you just got to keep pushing forward. Forget that. You know, every day's a new day. Pick it up and get shit done. I wonder. You know? If such a person was forced to take their first step towards the future, which way would they go? <laughs> Bruh, forward. What are you talking about? <laughs> I'm just musing to myself. <laughs> anyway, I propose we take a trip to Angel's Share tonight. We getting trashed or what's up? So we completed this. We completed the quest. We got 500 adventure experience. Um, the windless land. Did we finish that? Oh, okay. So he wants to go there. Yo, this gives tons of experience. Oh my goodness. Let's teleport over here. Okay. We're gonna teleport on over. Yeah, that's crazy. If you guys haven't done these quests, dude, make sure you do this. There's actually quite a few world quests that I have not done. Um, so make sure you guys do these quests, man. That's that's a huge chunk of experience. If you're trying to get 42, dang. I think this quest is the 30, 34 or 36. I, I can't remember. Um, let's check out. Let's see what happens here. Let's see what happens. We're going to get sloshed. Sloshed. He just gave me 500 experience for that one. What's up, Duluth? What's up, baby boy? Oh, Stanley, he's pissed. Look at him. My family hates me. Oh, God, that face. Uh, this is awkward. Tell me, Stan. Tell me what should I do? Huh. Huh? Why does he keep repeating his own name? There's another Stanley. <laughs> Surely not. Even I've never heard tell of a second Stanley. <laughs> oh, Stanley. It should have been me. I should have been the one to die in the Melchibari that day. Why won't your spirit come and stop me from Oh. Why? Why? Oh, no. So maybe he was in the battles with Stanley, but Stanley is a new Stanley that wants to be an adventurer. So he's trying to get rid of his ghost of the Stanley. By helping another Stanley. Are you guys following? <laughs> Shit. If only you hadn't had to save a rookie like me, you would have never died in that windless corner. Damn! You were a renowned adventurer, destined to become a legend one day. But now, that'll never happen because your life was cut short. And all because of a worthless tag along. Bro, this is crazy. Uh, does anyone get what's going on? Here? Yeah, I just explained it, Paimon. Jeez. I think our friend really did make it to the Mayor Javari. And I think the tragedy he encountered there was real too. Yeah. But the real adventurer, the real Stanley, that was his partner. R.I.P. Stanley. R.I.P. The real Stanley is the one who died to save our Stanley. Damn. Wait. So the only reason our Stanley is called Stanley in the first place is because he stole the other Stanley's name? Paimon. <laughs> what? I fear that may be the case. Stanley, for so many years I've lived in fear. Fear that Mondstadt will forget all about you. So I tell you adventure stories at every opportunity. Mm. So he's telling... Stanley's stories to keep the memory of him alive through himself. Mondstadt must remember. Mm. Stanley reached the center of the Madjabari. He's the greatest adventurer there ever was, and he lives on. Stanley will never die because I am Stanley. I am Stanley. I'm sorry, Stanley. Getting too old. Now. Dang, poor guy. Are you guys planning on me dropping much longer? Nah, dude, we good. Yikes! We're busted. We're good. Don't worry about it. Enjoy these tatas. 
That angle, though. Ooh, girl. All right, what's up? I'll let you look at my boobies. How you feel about that? Go away. Oh. Save your questions. Just leave me in peace. Okay. But, but I want to know. Leave now. Don't make me tell you again. We gonna fight? Honorary night. Venti and Paimon. I'm so glad you guys are here. Or maybe he'll live in the mood. I've been looking for you everywhere. I wanted to thank you again for helping me find the sword and shield. My parents are finally supporting me. Sweet, bro. Oh, really? Yeah, really. Is that a leak in onions on his? They're gonna pay for someone to fix up the sword of brilliant valor and shield of magnificent honor for me, so I can take them out on the road. He's gonna fucking die. That's wonderful. So, Jack, is this the part where you bid farewell to Mondstadt and set off on your intrepid trip traversing to that? No, not oh. yet. I still don't have what it takes to go too far from home just yet. At least he knows he can't. Besides, I'm sure Stanley still has a few stories left to tell. <laughs> They're what inspired me to become an adventurer in the first place. That's lit. That's lit. Stanley, I... Oh, you're drunk again. We'll see you tomorrow then. I passed After out. your hangover wears off. Maybe you can tell me some more of your stories? He's faking it. I bet she's faking sleeping. Stanley's really fond of that kid, don't you think? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Jack. Oh, shit. What if Jack is the other Stanley Stanley's son? Jack left. Oh. Maybe. I, I don't see. know. No, because he has parents, but... Well, thank you for not telling him about my secret. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just making shit up by now. Huh? All of a sudden, you're facing the facts? That isn't like you. Just now, I couldn't bear to look at him. I knew he was faking shit. His adventurous spirit is so pure, unblemished. Oh. Just a weary old feckless fraud. But that kid is a brand new shining star, full of potential. Hmm. I cannot allow his dreams to be crushed. Don't let your dreams be dreams. Um, you're not a total fraud. Stanley's adventure stories and experiences, they're all true, aren't they? Stories? Experiences? What's the point of them anymore? Mm. To be honest, my memories of adventuring and of Stanley, they're hazy these days. You getting old, Doc? That's my biggest secret of all, and my biggest fear. Mm. All these years, I've been living to tell his story. But his personality and the details of his life? I don't remember them clearly anymore. <laughs> but the one thing I can never forget mm. is that he died in a windless land where his spirit can never be recovered. His whole life he'd been drowning in guilt. All that remains is his imaginary friend. Shit. Exactly. Even in his memory, the real Stanley isn't the living, breathing friend he knew at all. Mm -hmm. Instead, He's become fixed on the image of him as that battle-scarred warrior. Bro, can you hear talking that shit? image has held him captive his entire life. He's literally right in front of you. You're making him more depressed. I'm too old. I never let go. But still, so much has slipped away. That's right. Don't let your life pass you by, boys and girls. All right? Completely and utterly worthless. Nah, you... No oh, God. To go that way. No adventure ever. Oh. Hans Archibald. Well, that was a weird, abrupt... Switch. My true name? How did you know? <laughs> oh shit, Venti, let's go! I, I can hear the wind blowing in the Mare Javari. <gasps> oh I always believe shit. You existed. Will you hand me your old friend's spirit? Yo, Venti, what a G, baby! <laughs> I, I, I can't believe it. Thank you all. And thank you, Lord Barbados. Yo, let's go, bro! It's gonna take me some time to calm back down. I did not expect that. Yo, I'm hype right now. I think that I'm gonna be okay. Hell yeah, dude. Bro, that was lit.
Oh, wonderful. <laughs> Stanley reconnected with his true self and Jack can finally go his own way. This calls for a celebration. And by celebration, I do, of course, mean libation. All right, I got you. I got you. You deserve it. Libation? You mean you're not leaving this tavern till you're too drunk to walk, right? <laughs> <laughs> no, the wine here is too expensive. Oh, Jack still owes me some wine, though. He promised me a rare vintage in exchange for helping him out, remember? Mm -hmm. I'll head off to fetch the wine. See you shortly. Let's meet at the usual place. All right. Yo, that was sick, dude. I have no clue. What a I time I never heard of it. Hey, toy that bird. I think I know where it is. It's probably the tree. Oh, hey. It's probably the tree. It's probably the tree. Oh, it's not. Oh, he's up top. I thought he was gonna be at the tree. I mean he goes there to heal himself, right? But I figured he'd be at the tree, but he's not. He's at the statue. Weird. Okay. Well, because it is a statue. Of himself, right? So, I get. Oh, mother, bro. Why do you? Why do you want to go that way? There we go. Okay. Okay. We did. We did. Whew. All right, bud. What's up? You made it. I did. Finally. Mm -hmm. Just tell us who <laughs> you mean next time, okay? Yeah, I mean. We everywhere. We really didn't though. <gasps> you at least manage to find your wine? Yep. Uh, well, <laughs> sort of. Jack made it out to be a rare collector's edition vintage. When actually it's just a half bottle of regular cider. <laughs> a half bottle? <sighs> this takes me back. That's a good view. That's a really good view. I like how it zooms out while you're uh, just chilling. Like, it's not like... You could literally take in the view right now. The first time I saw this view, mm. I hadn't even taken on this form yet. What form was he? It was about 2,600 years ago, before the world had come under the rule of the Seven. What if he was like a dragon or something? At that time, old Mondstadt was ruled by a tyrant who sealed off the city's perimeter with a ferocious hurricane. Mm. Even the oh, oh, didn't mean to skip that. Sorry. Oh, Pina remembers. Nowadays, it's known as Storm Terror's Lair, right? You mentioned it before. Yeah. That's right. The tyrant of the winds who once ruled from that tower was Decarabian, god of storms. Oh, snap. Back then, I was but a wisp among the thousand winds. I wasn't a god of anything. I didn't even have a human form. Huh. I was just a tiny elemental being who lived in the wind. Weird. A gentle breeze bringing subtle changes for the better. Or tiny seeds of hope. Huh. A tiny elemental being? Without a human form? Venti, do you mean you used to look different than you do now? Well, yeah, silly. Yep. My current form is not so different from the situation with fake Stanley. <laughs> I took the form of a friend. Huh. An old monster no transpired the story to be told. Where a tyrant ruled, I met a boy not that old. The lyre he played, and for a song he sought. But storm walls blocked blue sky. He mm. was sincerely distraught. I do so wish to see the birds in flight, said he, his strong eyes filling with light. But his voice was lost in the howling wind's churn. For the whirlwind takes and gives not in return. The true sky and songs that cageless soar. Were they not wishes worth fighting for? So the boy turned, extending his hand. Let us cast down the tyrant and his walls from this land. The young boy raised in the flag of revolt. Oh, and I damn. threw myself into freedom's tumult. Victorious were we who fought to be free. Gods fell, winds whipped, nations shook violently. In the smoke, a despot met his doom. A despot. We watched as his great tower fell. Oh too no! Monstat began anew. The story passed down, and since then, never has another worn its crown. Was that the Luke? So then what? Yo, this is sick. What happened to your friend? Oh, it's sad, but it's sick. Same situation with Stanley's friend. Say, Paimon, 
do you wish to hear the next part of the story? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, of course. The suspense is killing Paimon. Paimon, go pick up some apples. Paimon, could you fetch some uh, meat or fish? But Venti's telling his story. <laughs> what makes you suddenly want to have a meat feast? <laughs> a meat feast? <laughs> Getting a little peckish or something. Oh, so peckish. Huh. Paimon's had it up to here with you. <laughs> You know, you're so smart, it almost makes me uncomfortable sometimes. <laughs> but then, maybe it's right that true friends can tell what the other is thinking. Mm. A refreshing drink, a gentle breeze. <sighs> Moments like this always take me back. You know what's also crazy? That the world out there is actually the same. Like, you could, if I wasn't standing here right now, I could be running down there. Because look, like you can see the beams of light, you can see the dungeon down there, like everything's moving like it should be. Oh, there's a chest on top of that house. Oh, whoa! Back to a song that I first heard from him. I'm listening. Fly, fly away. Mm. Like a bird in the sky. See the world on my behalf. To the heavens may you fly. Dang. Bro, that was actually, to be honest, like, I didn't expect that from that quest. Did you guys? Like, I I thought it was going to be like, okay, this is silly. Okay, it's done. Like, this dude's dumb. Like, he's trying, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, he's such a terrible adventurer. He's got nothing going for him. And then they just hit you with all that heavy shit. And then Venti comes out and says that he's, that form is a form of somebody that he once knew. And that's why he's got that form. Yo, that's crazy. That was amazing, dude. That was liter that that was that was really good storytelling. I didn't, I didn't expect that at all. It just switch up, dude. Switch up after switch up. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys are new or if you disliked it or whatever, drop a thumbs up and hit the subscribe and make sure you guys hit the bell icon so you know when I post new content, guys. Yo, that was awesome, dude. That was cool. That was cool. I'll see you guys in the next one, all right? Peace out. Whee!